Hi. Today we're going to do a, a teriyaki pork. What do you call these things? Tenderloin. We're going to jazz it up a little bit because I'm batching it tonight and I want to do something different. Okay, don't judge. I'm just going to do it. All right, all right. Now, all right, all right. All right, all right. I don't know. We're just going on the little one because I got no charcoal. So as you get the leftovers out of the big green eggy thing, and I put them in there. And then I use my little fire starters, not fluid, and my chimney, and I made some fire, some charcoal, some coals. I made coals. All right, so this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna take this off, put it there, so it don't burn nothing. Now we're gonna take this and put it It's like I'm hearing everybody cheering. I don't know. Now, let's jazz it up. <coughs> My hands are all icky, icky, sticky, sticky, icky, icky, sticky, sticky. Normally, that's fun. Normally, when I'm batching it, they tend to end up that way. Stop. Now, we're just making this up on the fly. Let's do some honey so that everything Sticks, some honey, okay, and we're gonna go with some some chili because we like chili and some vodka and we're beet rooty beer. Mm. That's good stuff. Let's get some chili on. Oh, spread it. Yeah. Mm. Okay. Well. You slice it anyways. That's probably a little bit too much, but and then because we want a little bit more heat. Really didn't intend for that much to be on there. And I don't want to burn my hands off like the last time, so that's ah, good. It's just chilly. It's not like it's really hot stuff, but Sri Racha. Yes, I said Sri Racha. Because that's what it is. It's Sri Racha. Let's get some of that on there. <laughs> yummy tummy in my yummy thing. Now we're going to let that go for a somewhat long time. So, a um, couple of things I wanted to say. Um, first, can you see it? Can you see it? Yes, you can see it. This right here. You don't see a lot of it. This is a Silver Fire Super Dragon. No, it's not the Super Dragon. It's the Silver Fire stove of some sort or another. I've got about four or five different versions of Silver Fire Biomass stoves. They rock. These things are awesome. I was wondering, do you guys want to see how to cook on these things? Because I got a bunch of them. He, Todd over at Silver Fire is a sponsor of mine on my other channel. For those of you who don't know, I've got another channel called Lobuck. Lobuck Prepper, don't judge me. I'm not a doomsday prepper. <sighs> Stop it. But I got a lot of these things so you can cook off rig. You can use poop from a vegetable eating animal. Only the vegetable eating animals like cows and goats and rabbits. Stuff like that. Um, or you can just use sticks and twigs. And this thing is freaking amazing. You can cook inside the house with one of these. I'm not going to go into detail because I got lots of. I got a solar oven over there. I uh, got a, a solar stove. Not a solar stove, but solar. I miss mine. I got a bunch of different ways to cook. Do you guys want to see that? If so, tell me in the compliments below. The what? Comments below. And I, I say compliments because normally when I go like that, I get compliments. Just just go with me, okay? Just go with me on it. The other thing, next weekend, <laughs> I am finally going to hang out with T-Roy. Hopefully he's going to be responsible. Um, and not, not smirmish my good-natured thing. Also, is going to be there. God damn it, I forgot his name again. 
I'll bring it up the next time I talk. It's like aim them and claim them. Grilling, cooking, smoking. That dude. I'll bring it up the next time I come back. So, y'all, that's that part. Bring it back when it's, like, completely done. Okay. So, we're running. I went 20 minutes. Stop it. 20 minutes on one side and 10 minutes I turned it over and then I just turned it over just a second ago or maybe eight minutes ago I don't know and I got confused because I was thinking about the other day I was sitting there thinking to myself thank god it's Wednesday then I said no it's Thursday I said I'm thirsty too and I said then let's have a drink it happened and then I'm dealing with Anum and Clamum grilling. He wears this dumb cowboy hat. He's a cowboy fan. Can you believe that shit? A cowboy fan of all things. How rude. Unacceptable behavior, sir. Unacceptable. All right, let's get this off. I can't think. <coughs> I can't think about it. It's just unruly behavior. Look at that. Yum to the yum yum. Yum to the yummy yum yum. Okay, we're gonna take that off. Then we're gonna make a sandwich. So now I'm gonna take a bun and I'm gonna put a bun on the grillerator, the grilly thingy, my bobber thing right there. That, let's put that there and there. And then that'll be good. We'll just leave that on. Get hotter. Okay, now let that rest and let that crisp. And then, and then we'll be back, okay? You didn't see me look at my remote, did you? So you don't know I'm doing... Ah, I ruined it, I'm telling you. Okay. Aim them and claim them, dude. I don't know, man. I'm going back and forth on, on comments, and he's like, I'm a true blue cowboy fan. It's like you may as well just take off your panties and throw away your bra, dude. I don't know what that meant. Stop it! Big gummy down there. Stop this, Justice. Stop. Anyway, I'm going to be hanging out with him next weekend. Cray, cray, right? And T-Roy Cooks. Now, some of you might not see this until like eight years down the road. Next weekend is April 11th, 2015. So let's cut into this thing. Uh-oh. Yeah, we will let it rest. We got our bun on there. Let's see. We come prepared here. Let's get some more Wadi de Cub in there. And some Rudy beer. I'll bet that's him again. I'll bet. I just bet because them cowgirl fans are persistent little pricks. They just don't know when to stop until they get arrested. <laughs> <laughs> I bet it is. I bet nope. This is CNN. <sighs> I hate CNN. Okay, now let's hydrate. You gotta maintain hydration when you cook. <sighs> okay, let's cut into this and see what happens in the world. Yeah, you know, should I go on a bias? Is that what it's called? Why is there a hair? <clears throat> yum to the yum yum. Mmm, look at that. Let's get that one. We're going to make sandwiches out of this. Did I tell you that? Listen to me then. Yum. I don't have good knives. I'm sorry, folks. Because I'm broke. Hits the, 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 the generic vodka. In the plastic bottle. There's a lot of peppers on that. Eh, 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 eh. Uh oh, that one just fell apart. Mmm. Mmm. Oh my god. That is yummy, yummy upon the tummy, tummy. I bet it's gonna be good in a sandwich. Alright. Look at that. Yeah. 
Mmm. That's three rock chop. Kicks up that flavor. And those those chilies. I love heat. Heat is so good. Okay. You tell me I didn't burn it? Nope. I didn't even barely catch it. WTF? LOL. SMH. I don't know. Okay. Let's put some of these guys on here. Get a couple big ones. Like right, so. Hmm? Hmm? Ah, that's good. Okay, like that. Then we're going to get a couple of naders. One. And a two. Don't forget your biohazard protection. Biohazard? No. Your serve safe. Your, no, that's a different company. I used to teach that. I know you can't tell by watching me cook. Some lettuce. Only thing that make this better? The bacon. All right, oh, that one got good. Boom, boom. Trum, trum. Okay, let's taste it. Taste it, taste it, taste it. <laughs> yeah, no, one more. Yeah, good luck. Mmm. That's really good. You all should try this. I can't stop eating. Stop it. Stop. Do it. By the way, get that link down there. Shop on Amazon. Even for your work. A lot of people buy office supplies from Amazon. That's where you should do it. But hit that link. Uh, you won't even notice the difference. Might get a little tasty. Do it, please. I'm broke. Bye.